All right, we're going to multiply 212 times 23. Okay, we're going to split it up. We're going to do, we're going to do 212 times 3 and then 212 times 20. Okay, you guys know the ones really well. We're going to go ahead and do 2 times 3, which is 6. We're going to do 1 times 3, which is 3. And then we're going to do 2 times 3, which is 6. Now we're going to go ahead and multiply by the 20. Okay, and we're just going to multiply by 2. So to know that we're to know that we're really multiplying by 20, put your magic zero down here. Okay, we're going to go ahead and do 2 times 2, which is 4. Then we're going to do 1 times 2, which is 2. And then we're doing 2 times 2, which is 4. Now since we just multiplied these in parts, we need to go ahead and add them together. Because the 636 is 212 times 3, and the 4240 is a 212 times 20. So we need to make sure that we add these together that we get 212 times 23. If we add our 1s, we get 6. If we add our 10s, we get 7. If we add our 100s, we get 8. And we add our 1000s, we get 4 to get a final product of 4,876.